Welcome back to another video. Team T is TZL, your 25 year old California lawyer. So currently it is Friday evening. Just found out that I'll have to do more work than I thought on the weekend, um, but I'll get a head start probably tonight or right after I record this intro. But before we even get into this video, please remember to hit that subscribe button for more videos like this, Adventures Around the Bay Area, California and the World lawyer take videos where we do reactions on celebrities you may love or hate get jail time and we do reaction videos on funny tv court moments we have car vlogs food vlogs dessert vlogs literally everything in between so please hit that subscribe button during one of my meetings today um with the, one of my clients i had a nice uh nice little gest gesture like in the meeting uh we're talking we're probably maybe 20 minutes into the conversation and he randomly goes you you sound really young how old are you <laughs> and you know this is one of those moments where you kind of want to feel good that you're you're a young attorney um you know maybe younger than most attorneys in the state or you know the united states or whatever um but a part of you is like you know if you reveal how young you are then people might see you as stupid or less knowledgeable uh which may be true obviously you know there are more experienced lawyers out there that obviously are a lot smarter just be through experience um and i tell him i'm 25 and he basically reacts in a way where he's like proud of me and whatnot which was a nice gesture interesting one that i did not see coming but in any case i should head out now i have plenty of work to do um and i'll catch you guys later Welcome back to another day of my lawyer life. So currently it is Saturday morning. Let's head out. Well, the day is pretty much over at this point. Um, at our last stop, um, for now, I guess we had to grab food. We haven't decided where we're going to grab food. Um, I'm not 100% sure I'm not uh, if I'm actually even going to go for the ride unless it's on the way home um, But I'm pretty sure we're gonna grab food, at, you know, like after we go home and everything um, So yeah, I probably won't come along. I do have work as I mentioned in the morning. I had that meeting um, We ended up going home not that much later uh, after um, making the first couple of stops actually when I recorded the first piece uh, we went home. We had family coming over for one. We had somebody um, coming to see uh, This little situation at our house. We need something to get fixed So we had somebody come see that all kind of in the same hour or so and I had that meeting while I was at home So like um, I think it was like either yesterday or the day before that um, I got this email, I'm not gonna say from which Mercedes dealer, but I got an email from a Mercedes dealer. It's actually the one I go to um, when I need something repaired. Um, but I got an email saying that the market is pretty hot for pre-owned certified cars. Um, I guess they know I bought mine certified. Um, obviously it was pre-owned. Um, and they basically said that they would make offer for the car if I was willing to sell it um and they gave me the number to call at the dealer um to discuss what they would be willing to offer and you know i thought about it um and i think i might actually be willing to depending on how much to actually offer so there's no guarantee there but you know if i were to get rid of it i would have to have a backup in mind already so that's where it gets kind of interesting um in a 200 mile radius from where i live um, there's only, in terms of the C63 and the C63S, there's only about five in the 200 mile radius. Um, from that five, only two are certified um, and being sold at a Mercedes dealer, the other three are not. Um, so it just goes to show you how, um, how rare these cars are. Um, it was difficult finding the one I found. Um, and obviously I kind of had to settle um, since I originally had wanted a C63S sedan um, and I ended up getting a C63 coupe um, so that kind of goes to show you how hard they are to find so if I were to get rid of this one 
um, I pretty much would not be able to get another one. So we barely got home and we already have dinner planned out and we're pretty much gonna go grab it like right away. So I decided why not take the Benz out. It's been a while since I've driven it. A um, couple of weeks, I believe, um, in terms of actually taking it on the road. I know I moved the car around like uh, over a week ago. Um, but yeah, so I'll just come along for this and you know, see how work pans out later. But going back to the conversation from earlier, still trying to decide um, what I'd be interested in if I did end up taking the offer that they put on the table. Um, I do have pretty decent doubts that we would actually um, come up with a number that me and the dealer both agree on. Um, but you know, I am thinking about M3s, I am thinking about Range Rovers, I am thinking about I8s. Um, and yeah, there's not that much on the plate that I would actually consider since I am looking for something that would be reasonably reliable for now um, since I really can't afford repairs or whatever so it's not like I could get a Lambo tomorrow um, because if something went wrong like I mentioned a long time ago before I got this car um, you know I couldn't afford repairing a Lambo um, so it has to be something reasonable at least to some degree but we'll just see what happens. Welcome back to another day of my lawyer life. So currently it is Sunday morning. I'm just here to quickly cut out the vlog. I worked last night, um, pretty late actually. I had to jump onto work right now. It's like nine o'clock um, and I want to jump into it right away. I'll finish as much as I can, send it off um, and go from there. I have to prep for tomorrow's hearing as well today. Um, so it's pretty much going to be a work day, I guess, um, for the most part, maybe, um, even though it is Sunday. Um, just one of those unfortunate weekends at this point um, and I'll catch you guys later in the next vlog anything I do record today if I do um, that will be in the following episode um, so please remember to like share and subscribe check out my clothing brand at the triumphco.us triumph your dreams await